Hi, I'm Stephanie Cutter, Deputy Campaign Manager at Obama for America. Mitt Romney recently launched a new TV ad that blatantly twists President Obama's words on small business owners and entrepreneurs. Romney's not telling the truth about what the President said and is taking the President's words out of context. Romney claims the President told entrepreneurs they didn't build their own businesses. Actually, he didn't say that. And even the Washington Post called this attack ridiculous. Anyone who's seen the President's actual remarks knows the truth. The President said that together, Americans built the free enterprise system that we all benefit from. You can see the full clip at barackobama.com forward slash build. Now this isn't the first time the Romney campaign has twisted the President's words, and it won't be the last. But every time they do this, we need to call them out. Here's what's important. President Obama has consistently fought for small businesses and entrepreneurs. The President knows hardworking people turning ideas into successful businesses built the American middle class. But if the Romney campaign wants a debate about who will step up to support small businesses, we're ready to have it. So let's put the candidates' plans side by side. Romney would gut investments in infrastructure, making it harder for small businesses to operate and ship their products. He would cut investments in education, leaving small businesses without a skilled workforce. And he'd cut investments in technology, making that next big American invention a little harder to reach. He'd do all of this even as he gives more tax breaks to millionaires and billionaires and cuts taxes for companies that ship jobs overseas. Now, President Obama is taking a very different approach. He's cut taxes 18 times for small businesses. He's invested in our roads, bridges, and highways. He's doubled Pell Grant scholarships and reformed the student loan system to help students afford college. And he's committed to making sure every community in America is connected to the digital age by expanding broadband access. Ironically, Mitt Romney knows better than anyone that business can't always do it alone. When Bain and Company was on the brink of bankruptcy, Romney himself negotiated a $10 million bailout with the FDIC. And under Romney, several of the companies Bain Capital profited from received tax breaks. Apart from the flagrant hypocrisy, these attack ads make you wonder, does he even understand how our economy works? You and I know how it works. We build our businesses through hard work and initiative, with the public and private sectors working together to create a climate that helps us grow. President Obama knows that, and he's fighting to strengthen our economy on that basic principle. We need to get his back as the Romney campaign launches these attacks. So please share this video with your friends, and not just your friends who already support the president. We all have a relative who spends all their time forwarding those crazy email chains. So make sure they get the facts too. Thank you for your help.